Minutes. Thank you, Chairman Scott, for this time. Throughout my career, I have witnessed the direct positive impact of programs and shelters such as the St. Jude House in Crown Point, Indiana, and the Haven House in Hammond, Indiana, provide hope and resources for survivors and help prevent and protect against domestic violence. That is why I rise today in strong support of H.R. 2119, the Family Violence Prevention Act and Services Improvement Act. The increase in domestic partner violence is alarming, particularly as many individuals have lost valuable resources to aid them due to the pandemic and are forced to remain in close quarters with their abusers. As an administrator of emergency assistance for 15 years, I remain deeply concerned about the mental, physical, and emotional trauma survivors and their children endure. As one of the most effective federal investments in preventing domestic violence, Congress must pass this measure to reauthorize and improve family violence and prevention service programs. I appreciate the leadership of Chairman Scott, Representative Macbeth, and the Education and Labor Committee, and I encourage my colleagues to support this measure. Thank you, Madam Speaker, and I yield back my time.